so it really helped our other sports. And then Brian ordered what he wanted. No. Yeah, that's so, what you did. Yeah, so uh, the biggest goal was uh, we wanted to have a rack. And my goals are to have a program that's going to grow with the athletes. So as their needs change, the program's got to change with them. And then I want to be able to be position specific with how we program. So these racks allow us to do that. I mean, they've got attachments that allow us to do jammer extensions, which is a full body explosive movement. Um, we have a different size bench over in the uh, those six racks back there where our big guys are going to train to keep them in a better, safer position as they press. Um, we've got uh, tracks in the floor that allow us to attach bands. We do banded jumps, banded squats, banded um, presses. Um, and then within the racks, we have dumbbells at every single platform that go from 12 to 125. So at no point do we get log jammed. At no point do we run out of any piece of equipment that we may need. We got to do everything we need right on these platforms. But it's just it's a it's a rack and a flooring system that's going to allow us to program exactly how we want. And then on top of that, it's got the logos are, are excellent. The guys are excited about the look of the rack. And, and, but for me, it's all about the function that these racks give us. What uh, you, you didn't have enough room to get the whole team in here. What does this do for you? What's yeah, right? we went from 14 racks to 23. So now we can put uh, we can fit the full team in here. And at certain times of the year, that's extremely beneficial, especially in the summer. If I want to do an upper body lift as a team and then go right outside and condition as a team, we can do that now. Um, during the camp, if there's a time when we need to get everyone in at once, we can do that now. Uh, so just being able to do that was a huge part of, of our programming. So we can shape ourselves around their schedule so we're as effective as possible for them. And we're not, you know, guys aren't waiting around to train. We can be as, as efficient as possible. And how did our guys work this summer? God, um, this summer was unbelievable. I and mean, we, were, we were training in louder mill, waiting for this to get done. And I mean, I, all we needed was weights. And, and they're, they're willing to do anything you wanted to do. So this is just going to give us that next little bit where we can write that exact program that they deserve and that they need to go to the next level. But the work ethic is not an issue. The, the standards is not an issue. And the guys have not worked in this new weight room? No, they have not. So that those will be fun to get them in here the first time and, and let them start using some of the different things that we demoed to them. Yeah, they wanted it. Brian would let them touch it. He said, we're starting out new when we get back, so we'll do that. Yeah. Let's move down to the nutrition. Area. So everybody move down with it. Well, can you run up a dub G for us? 